Here we are with My Hero Academia Season 5 Episode 11. So yeah, if you like what you see, leave a like, subscribe, or comment, let me know what you think. And I would say, let's get to the episode. I just dislike the recaps so much. <clears throat> I don't know why they do this. It's just, technically it's just been a week if you watch it when it came out. And otherwise, like I said, in the last episodes, every time, you just watch it probably like back to back or something, or like each day or something. There's like no reason why they have to do this every episode. Just fuck him up. <laughs> I can't hurt anyone anymore. I mean, that's basically part of the training, right? To hurt each other and not hold back, really. Because if you have to consider that you have to hold back all the time, then, yeah, these training sessions would be so pointless. <clears throat> I mean... Bakugo could do nothing because he basically explodes shit. Or the guy that comes at Bakugo with his razor blades that he can like that he can like get on his whole body. He has fucking blades as his quirk. If he attacks he hurts people, that's his whole deal. <clears throat> or Todoroki? Just freezing and burning everyone. <laughs> and he has that condition. He's like, I, I can't hurt anyone anymore, dude. What should I do? <laughs> I mean, I know that he has one for all. So if he has no control over it, he can really mess people up. But I mean, it's kind of dumb <laughs> that he's like, I can't hurt anyone anymore. <laughs> Chaos. They all want to mess each other up. <coughs> Let them have it. Come on, Deku. You are strong enough, you should have pulled him, not the other way around. <coughs> yeah. 
Yeah, pretty much. So go edit, use your quirk. I mean, she she just uses acid, so she just melts everyone, basically. Damn. Yeah, some moves, actually, for once. <laughs> <sighs> I mean not really, he's not really fighting, he's just bouncing. <laughs> Nah. Keep fighting. Mess each other up. Oh, the, oh, he wants his quirk. Uh oh, <laughs> what? Will, I can, I mean, he can't take it, right? Because you have to give one for all on your own, right? You have to give it to someone. You, it can't be taken from you. So he can't take the quirk. Otherwise, he would go out of control, too, I guess. What? How? That makes no sense. And he didn't even touch him. Doesn't he have to touch someone? Fuck him up. How did he get up without using his quirk? Damn, the hairstyle. <clears throat> I wonder how this stuff works. Because it looks like he can like manipulate it with his mind or something like, like this. It's not that he yeah, like uses his hands or something to use it really. Kind of interesting how it works. Oh, oh, he controls it now. Now, like, wing it at him. <laughs> oh, he throws it back.
Oh Nord. He has kind of like the same ability as Shinsho now and Aizawa, right? Just that he that he has these bandages, whatever, as like an, a quirk. It's not bandages; they they said whip, right? But it's kind of similar. What's this? Oh, his mouthpiece. His mask. Ah, not complete control yet. Obviously. That was more than a second. <laughs> yeah, so I guess it drains more power, right? Eight percent only. Especially when you run away. Because all the other guys in Midoriya seem are far away. Three? Or maybe that's just a bluff. What? Eh? I don't understand. Fire?
but he didn't touch them. He didn't touch them. Yes. Booba. Hell yeah, that's what I like to see. Oh, <laughs> he connected. No escape. Don't talk, Midoriya. I feel like that could be the one thing that could happen, that Shinzo says something, Midoriya feels bad for him or something, and just answers, and bam, brainwash. <laughs> Okay, no. All right. Is she standing like this? I thought that would be like a twist at the end. I mean, in the last match, now he didn't really do much, right? New quirk, Pog? Body on the line, mm hmm. Getting close and touchy. <laughs> mm hmm. <laughs>
<laughs> Choke him. Okay. So he gets into the hero class, but which one? A or B? If he gets into class A, <clears throat> I would think that it wouldn't be so good, right? Because most characters in class A are not shown at all. <laughs> most of them have like only like minimal amounts of screen time. Um, so he would probably be one of those, I guess. And if he gets into class B, then yeah, he also has like minimal minimal amounts of screen time. <laughs> so it doesn't really matter in which class he gets. And yeah, I guess we go straight into the next episode. So yeah, like I said, um, <clears throat> that's one of the things. When you start My Hero Academia, you see all these characters that look amazing. This is actually a good time that I can talk now, because it's a, a dumb recap anyway. <clears throat> you get all these characters that have like unique looks and unique abilities and everything. And you think, man, we have all these characters. I can't wait to see what's going on with them, right? To see something of them and see how they progress. But actually, there's just like a handful of characters that are like somewhat relevant, right? <coughs> like Midoriya, obviously. Shoto is relevant. Bakugo is relevant. Um, What's his name? Kirishima, Red Riot, is somewhat relevant um Uraraka is a bit relevant Yozuru is i think a bit relevant i mean but it already starts like to thin out like it's it's basically Midoriya Bakugo Shoto those are like the big main three characters of class A and everyone else gets less and less screen time. <clears throat> then you have like, for example, Tail Tail Guy. I don't know his no I don't even know his name. He has like very little screen time. Mineta only like really for like the loot jokes and stuff and shit like that. Um, yeah, <clears throat> it's like we have all these characters, and most of them get barely any screen time. Like, only a handful, like, really get some development. Like, with um, Ida and Shoto in Season 2, I think? Um, when Ida wanted to revenge his brother, and then Shoto came around. <clears throat> but, like, most of them don't get that. <clears throat> second year well how long is the 
this is first year still going to be probably another six seasons <laughs> But it just can be given, not taken. Right? So it shouldn't work. Isn't she's Eri, right? If I remember correctly, I'm so bad with names. Yeah, <laughs> maybe to reverse time that he loses a, the that he loses a quirky touch from Midoriya, maybe because why else, right? I mean, it should just stay for five minutes, right? But he said that it can, can't stay longer or something. I don't know. Off go training. Bakugo wants to experience it. <laughs> he wants to beat him when he uses it. To show that he's better. <clears throat> yes. Nah. No one got that far, I guess. Kinda. Just that it works differently. You basically just store the quirks and give them over to someone else. Well, all for one, just takes them. was pissed. <clears throat> hmm. Interesting.
I'm getting hungry again. <laughs> Mineta, what the fuck? Well, I get way more in the future. <laughs> you were amazing how you got knocked out by the pipe. He's like, finally, it's time. I can teach him. Mm-hmm. Nah. Or is it maybe about him taking Ares quirk to use it, maybe? <clears throat> Dang. So some quirks he can't use, like it seems like. Ah, okay. So only when the power comes from the quirk itself, all the time, basically like Shoto. So technically... <clears throat> Could he copy Bakugo's quirk because he has to basically stockpile sweat, right? But maybe because he's sweating, he could use it.
after all sounds so weird. Yeah, if you say so, then I will try to do my best after all. Otherwise, I would have given up. Given up. It's winter. Nani? Who's this? One sounds like Bakugo and Shoto and All Might. Hey, it's time to take action. Imagine there are people in the water, they're all frozen and now they're all dead. Lots of talking. Carbonation. <laughs> That's interesting. Ooh. He fucks himself with his quirk and his tools.
slash freeze. Should have done that from the beginning. <laughs> Who is this guy? Mm-hmm. <laughs> no, just someone has to clean up this whole mess. <clears throat> All the eyes. Okay, seems like this is an after credit scene. Not a preview. Surprise, we celebrate. Hell no. Nah. <laughs> mm hmm. Okay, that was episodes. Let me know what you think. But yeah, I mean, I thought that Midoriya would maybe not use the new quirk that he got, right? But he did. Only if it was for like one move for a short moment um but very interesting that he's like i can't use this for a long time he thinks that and the quirk is like okay i'm staying back i won't come out anymore <laughs> that's interesting mm. and yeah like i said shinsho i feel like <clears throat> in the last match didn't really do much right i mean the only brainwash he got out was because Midoriya did it on purpose, right? To stop his new quirk. Um, and otherwise, he didn't do much, right? Um, and the whole thing with um, the one guy uh, that can take quirks, Mono, Mono Me, Mono Ma, Mono whatever. Um, he apparently hit Midoriya, but. It never looked like it. It looked very much like it that Midoriya dodged. So interesting that it counts as hit. Or they just animated it very badly in a way that it doesn't look like it. Um, which I think is a bit confusing or makes the whole thing a bit confusing. And yeah, interesting that his quirk can only work on quirks that are basically all the time at full potential right like for example um <clears throat> midoriya's quirk all for one uh one for all has no limit it just keeps storing energy right more and more and more and more so it just stores energy and there is like no limit so it never it will never be at a point where it's like finished basically and then you have like fat gum i think his name is and he has to eat and has to get fat right to, to be able to use his quirk um, but yeah, like for example, like I said in the episode, Bakugo could he use Bakugo's quirk because Bakugo needs 
squid, right? Um, without sweat, if there's nothing accumulated, then it wouldn't work. So does that count or because he can sweat too, it counts? What else could be a quirk that you accumulate that we have in the classes that we know? Do we have any that could be something like that? The sugar guy, maybe, because he has to eat sugar to get stronger, right? So that could be something, I guess. Um, but I think otherwise, no one really, right? Everyone else should have quirks that just work, I guess. Thinking about it. Wait. <coughs> Kirishima, maybe? I mean, he gets hard, right? But no, he doesn't really have to accumulate something to use the quirk. That's what it's all about, right? You have to accumulate something to use the quirk. He just gets hard and then he can get harder, but he doesn't accumulate the hardening. It just he does he just does it, right? And then he goes as hard as he needs to be. So I think that doesn't count. I guess Bakugo should count, right? Because he has to accumulate. I, I, I think they said earlier, like in one of the first seasons or something, that he has to accumulate sweat. And the more sweat he takes, basically, the bigger the explosion. So, I think that maybe should be something you accumulate, right? Sweat. Because depending on the sweat, it depends how strong the explosion is, I guess. Hmm, maybe. But yeah, I mean, otherwise, um, yeah, they have li the license now and did the first job. Um, Endeavor is now hyped because Shoto wants to get teached in the fireways. And otherwise, I would say there wasn't much else. I mean, Shincho gets into the class, but in the second year, and I mean, we are still in the first year for like five seasons. And six, uh, season six will probably be also like in this first school year, so... Will we ever get to season two? We don't know. Uh, will we ever get to, to the second school year or not? Um, we don't know. Can take forever as it stands right now because it took forever so far. But yeah, I guess that's basically it. There's nothing else really to say, I think, that is of interest, I would say. So yeah, if you like what you saw, leave a like, subscribe, or comment, let me know what you think. And I would say thanks for watching until next time. Bye-bye.